My name is Carol Caputo, and I'm the Executive Director of Ontario's Algoma Country. I represent 25,000 square miles of beautiful northern Ontario, and our geography starts at the town of Spanish and runs along Highway 17 in Lake Huron to Sault Ste. Marie, to Wawa and White River, and all the way up to the town of Hearst, over to Elliott Lake, and then back down to Spanish again. One of the things that we're most proud about is our sledding industry in this region. And our sledding industry comprises of dozens of clubs run by countless volunteers that go out day in and day out to keep our 1,400 miles of trails groomed for any consumers or tourists that want to come and visit us and take part in sledding in this region. Ian McMillan, I'm Director of Tourism for the City of Sault Ste. Marie. Sault Ste. Marie is a great gateway to snowmobiling in Algoma for a couple of reasons actually. One, as you can see over my shoulder, the International Bridge, it's a perfect feeder for that U.S. traffic. And just north of our city, we are the hub of the Ontario Federation of Snowmobile Trail System. The trails literally come to the back door of a number of hotel properties. From that back door, you can get onto those thousands of kilometers of trails and ride right across Ontario. We get a very, very large snowfall annually. It makes for some great riding. It's a very rugged terrain and some of the highest elevations in all of the northwest. So it's not like just simply snowmobiling across farmer fields. Here you have that varied terrain, everything from small mountains to riverbeds to canyons, and it makes it a much more interesting ride. Tracks and Trails is a very unique experience anywhere in that you can put a sled on a train right here in Sault Ste. Marie and take it north to a number of stops along the way. From a perspective of a snowmobiler, it's very rare that you can have that train experience and snowmobiling experience all at one time. 